Hi again everyone, I am back today playing some NHL GM mode. Not my pro. I know people are probably wondering what's going on with that series, but I will get to that series again. But I'm doing today my GM mode. And if people have seen the last video, um You see why um I'm not in a very good mood with my team right now. After a uh, two straight losses. Wait, which one is it? Is this one? It's this one. It must be that one. Oh. Let's delete everything carefully. Okay. Okay, we could do this, guys. We could pull it back and win. If not, then pff, I'll be trading some people. So let's sim up to this day. I'm just hoping teams are gonna try to trade me a goaltender because I need goaltending. Big time. But you know what? Before we even start this game. Oh, someone got a hat trick. Oh, Kess Kessler. Kessler. Can't even speak. I wanna actually know. Um, scouting's. What? It's done? Is it? Well, I'll let them tell me when it's done. Um, just want to check the trade block real quick. Just browse it. Uh, defenseman, snow. I think it's just all the same still, guys. Ryan Gianta, I would maybe would have got him, but not yet. Chicago draft picks and one to one. Danny Briere. No, I don't want him. Dallas Stars. Sergey Gonchard would be a good one, but I'm not gonna get him. I should check the free agency. What am I doing? Brian Campbell. Oh. I want one of these two defensemen, but I don't know if I can get them. Seven million dollars? Okay, never mind. Well, also, I have to get rid of the, um, a few players. Holy shoot, I have 15 defensemen. And I have 13 centers. Wow. Ew, this is not good. Well, I'm just going to check out the free agency real quick, guys. Then we'll start playing some games. And I was just in this mode. Why? Whoops, I just exited for no reason then. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha. Oh. I don't want to get the top defenseman, like, yeah, okay. Sammy Salo is a good defenseman, I think would be a good one. Ed Javanovsky is pretty good. Corey Potter. Al Gill! That's who I want to get, but I can't sign right now because my roster's full. But wait, I have an idea. I will sign him to a contract. More than he wants. And send him that. But before that, I'll play this game. Then I will be doing some trades before I get to the next thing. Whatever. Next. Before he tells me if he accepts it or not. No, I don't want these jer jerseys. So that's the one I'm looking for. I will take those ones because those ones are old school, but I still like them. So guys, we're going to see if we can win this game, because if we don't... I am doing bad for the year so far. We're like, there will be like, what? One and four? And then I'm going to be so sad, I'm going to maybe cry. Well, I won't actually cry. I'll just be a bit mad. Not full outrage. I don't want to do that. But we will try our best and win t t today's game. Because we won our first game and then everything just went downhill. Hi everybody, along with Eddie Olchek, Mike Emmerich right before game time here. 
it's an interesting sport in that sometimes your best players only wind up playing a third of the time, but boy, do they ever make a contribution. And that's why the other two thirds, Doc, have to be important. Team game hockey, that's exactly what it's all about. But when you have star players, those are the guys that get the meat of the I wonder who's in that. I think it might be Nikolai Habibulin. Paul's probably going to be one of those players on the ice in those high pressure situations. He told me before the game he really enjoys the challenge. Expect to see him in those crucial minutes. Let's look at the starting yep. netminders. He's the starter tonight as the season rolls on so many hours with the goalie coach, and it's worked for him and for the Oilers. Well, then I'm going to say Nikolai Boom's name. Miller, wow. A career of brilliance. All American at Michigan State. Outstanding goalie in the AHL with Rochester. Outstanding goalie in the NHL with Buffalo. Outstanding goalie in the 2010 Olympics for Team USA. Not our observations. Those were all awards. He is actually 1 1. Wait, did he get his win against us? Edmonton, Alberta. Hockey is being played as of now. Oh, God. Snapped up that right wing to Lander. And he glides on to center ice. The Canucks shift from defense to offense. To Daniel Sedin. Takes it on the wing. Propel to Verbata. Slides it to the point to Ham Hughes. A shot. Oh, pfft. why did I do that? That's the hall. Switch lines. Moves it to the shadow of the boards. Say. Moves up along the boards. Oh, and he is closed off emphatically. The fans along the glass gotta love that hit. The Oilers will start from their own end. That's Horkoff. No, Miller saved it again. Controlled through the middle. Gets in and he'll look over his options. The Oilers shift from defense to offense. Okay, um, pass it to someone. Onside pass it back. To pass it across. Oh my god, almost went in. He can start some danger here. Back near the blue line to Viznovsky. He's into the slot. A shot! Heads I really need boards. to switch my lines. Hard work for possession. Snatched up by Ham Hughes. He drives toward the slot. Could not be filtered through a strong play by Ferentz. Come on, number 16. The Canucks will start from their own end. Good distance on that one to Matthias. Oh, stick save. Just hold on to it, yes. Down to ice level, here's Ray Ferraro. There's not very many games you can put in the win column if your special teams aren't very good. You have to at least be able to play even most nights with the other team on the power play and penalty kill if you yes, expect yes, to yes. win. Just a tad under eight minutes have been played in the first period. Game still waiting for its first goal. Drop down to Dorset. That's the hall. Wing pass to hall. That's the Eberle. Nice Just gonna walk right in. Oh, no. Nope. I was trying to pass to the hall. Right up the side. It's Back hall. Takes that pass. Wow, what a glove save. Pointed to Tanif. Fires! Okay, no pass. Neutral zone. Fourth line on. Fourth line, second defenseman pair. Hoppy Bullens never say die attitude keeps this puck out of the net. What an miraculous stop! It looked like it went wide instead, um, but I guess it was a shot. Number seventy-eight. Quick work on the faceoff. Shoot. Laid on to Bonino. Oh wow. Collected by Hora. Passed up. Here comes Hamilton. Hamilton. It's an odd man rush. It's a three on two. I was trying to pass it back, not forwards. 
to Matthias, to Cassian, carries it up the wing. Picked up in the attacking zone. Terrific glove save. Uh. Swung between the blue lines by Hamilton. Let's it go. Got it all. You can't ask for a better opportunity in the scoring zone. What a great glove save. Well, we'll put the third line on. I don't feel like watching the save. And shot. Shot, save, whatever. Edmonton's got that win. Save. Ferrance has tripped up. That should be a penalty. What and happened? Cooper's got two on this one for tripping. Oh, Ferrance got tripped up? I think, yeah, did he dive? Let's see. He's got great stick positioning. Yeah, he dove. Oh, shoot. Look at that hit. Out from under him. If people just saw that hit, wow, that was amazing. Edmonton's power play often gives them an advantage in any game that they play. I think that'll be the case tonight, Doc, as their power play is much better than their opponents. But discipline will also play a key factor here tonight, Doc, as if they can stay out of the penalty box and keep the better power play off the ice, they should be in decent shape. And that one's just one. Oh, Everly gets the penalty. No? Cross looks over his options. Slid to Viznovsky. Oh. Slides it to the point to Dang. Wall. And this play is whistled down. It is offside. Dang, Abbott. Oh, there's Chris Pronger. Great, I got him out. Vancouver's collected another victory on the faceoff. Moved up the side by Henrik Sedin. That right into our bench. Over the glass, and a young lady from Shawinigan came up with that. How the heck do you know that? Vancouver's got that one to Henrik Sedin. Henrik Sedin's doing everything he can, guys, to get back to the bench after that. Oh, I took out Henrik. He was outnumbered, but not outskilled. Save! Good position in oh. the spot. Terrific opportunity, but it's off the mark. Marches on a cross to Puglia. Muscled long to Pronger. Just a normal save that time. He throws that just for a break. That was a hit. Arcock destroyed Henry. Watch this hit. Henrik's Boom. injury was apparent as soon as you saw this hit. Huge collision. Bone rattling check. Okay, we're still on the power play. Thank God. Good job on the draw. Oh, how good. Can he generate something? No, you're supposed to pass across. That's why the goalie's but whatever. Hey, okay, let's just get to the game. Good face-off win. Outstanding save by Miller. Talking about making it look easy. Let's it fly. Save. The Canucks score. Was that a power play or is that going to be a regular goal? Cause I came right to the marker actually. So we'll find no it's gonna be a regular goal. By I think two seconds. Everly's quick wrist shot surprised the goaltender in close. But only I get a pass that goes like that. Try it before, no no no. Finally the fucking the stupid passing go. stuff works. Oh wow, man! He had to jump on that quick because it went off his defenseman. Oh, sorry about the guys if I burped or something. Just say just a while ago. That's why. I'm the Canucks with a clean win on the draw. He covers and holds on. Okay, face off again. Go, go, go. Good job tying the man up on the face off. Teammate comes in. Daniel Sedin's caught a stick up high, and the referee's arm is up. 
Dang. What? Oh my god, number 64, really? So I have to Vancouver's getting their first chance of the game on the power play. Beat him on that one. Oh my god. Wonderful save. It didn't look like he had a thing to shoot at. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. Dragged through the neutral zone by Everly. Offside is called. Somebody got over anxious. Okay. After that defensive zone turnover, the goaltender had to make an excellent Boom, stop. Boom, Nick Haddon the just sits there, the blocks approval. it with the pads. He's like, nope, defend. But he has to be ready, just in case. The Oilers prevail on the draw. Oops. Mashed in. They must retreat and start back again. Taken up near the boards by Edler. Takes a perfect pass. Well, that's what your wings are for. They give it to you right in the center. Oh, my God. Petrie's got it on his stick, trying to clear. Miller's back behind his net and is able to stop it right there. Gathered in by Ham Hughes. Takes that pass behind the net. Well, he got destroyed Long behind the net. Pass to Bonino. Can he make him chase it? Ahead on that left wing to Horkoff. Miller's. Many yards gained to Daniel Sedin. And he's held up against the boards. Moves it to the barrier at center ice. In on the two on two. Can they get reinforcements here? Propelled to Spiza. Slid just inside the line to be. Oh, I just passed it away. Vancouver's going back to get restarted with their advantage. Oh, what a funny bounce it did. Guys on the ice, he can pass. He did that. Let's see. Yep, finally moves. Angled to Spiza. Takes it up that side. Offside stops the clock. Good. Gives everyone to rest a little bit. So satisfying to have delivered a hit like that. Down here, you can hear this hit through. Boom, Hamilton just nailed him. Good job, Hamilton. Petrie's done an excellent job over the last couple of games defensively. Where he stands out the most is his ability to get into the shooting lanes and block shots. Flip to the opposite corner. A chance to clear. And it does. Carries it up the side. Oh, that's a nice cut pass. Let's see what happens. The Oilers have forced another turnover, Doc. They hit it a oh, off the post. Off the post. Inside that came close. The final minute of the period. That covers some acreage to Bonino. Must on, everybody. get it out. Perfect centering pass. Marvelous save. No time on that one. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. Uh oh, I'm defenseman. I didn't want to be defenseman. Oh, another save. And he'll hold on. 16 seconds and 15 seconds. So I think we might be able to get the power play done just before the penalty's done. The period's done. Boom, Horkoff. Two great passes to him and just twice it's hit something else. Vancouver's got it again. Behind the net by Ham Hughes. The Oilers have killed it all. Oh, penalty's off, First and I almost scored. In the, books. the Oilers leave the ice with a Just came up a little lead. short. A look now at the lopsided shot totals. An impressive 15 for Edmonton and 6 for Vancouver. It has become a one goal game, and that game. Boom, look at that amazing pass. And he just barely got it in the net. For our intermission. They have no hits on us. Penalties are about even, but penalty minutes are different. If you want to see, if you want to talk about that. Any, we're about to enter the second period here. What did you think? Make some noise. The Canucks have to feel really good with the goaltending performance they got in that first period. 
they got to turn the offensive play around. One way to do that, use the body. Get in on a forecheck, play a physical game. Oh, he just got double laid out. He got double hit. Up the left side to Hall. With a shot. He got his glove on that one. Using the point. He's got it. Save. He got double hit there, man. That was amazing hit. He gets just shoved against the board, and then I come at him and just lay him out even harder. I was like, nope. Miller's put to the test after a turnover right in front of him. Didn't you turn it over, Miller? Because he went fired it behind the net. Edmonton's got that face-off win. Wrist shot, magnificent glove save. Go, look out here. What do you think? These, these guys are squaring off. MC's gonna go. Oh, I'm losing, big time. Stop blocking it. It looks like I'm gonna lose this fight. Yeah, they're lost down. the fight. Refs were watching and they're gonna add all this up. He threw a lot of punches, didn't land many. Eventually he just says to heck with it and he takes them down. Yeah, whatever, he's pretty good. Next time we'll win the fight. Well these guys will have five minutes to get back dressed. Oh he, he was picking a fight with Torkov. No, don't take my centerman. I need him. Edmonton's quick on the draw. Blocked. A five minute major. To Defense to offense begun by Richardson. Uses the middle of the ice for Hansen. With a hope and a prayer, he flops it to the opposite corner. To Yakupov. On to Horkov. Julio, nope. On a cut pass. To Richardson. Oh, he's yep. been looking for that hit all night. Fourth line on. Point blast. Save. Takes it behind his own cage. Swept on to Bonino. Driven toward center in the shadow of the boards by Daniel Sedin. Jabbed away. Oh, what an amazing pass. The and then does the light tap in. Whatever. Oh, we'll bounce back. Was in a ready position to accept that puck and put it in as a one timer. Edzo, good air time on this pass. No one would have saw that guy. Look at this. Boom. Oh, Nikolai Ivan just came. He would have got the leg out a bit sooner. He could have maybe saved it, but you know what? Whatever. We'll get a goal back. Both of these teams have connected once. Edmonton's prevailed again on the face off the neutral zone. Got that in the trap. You and your stupid glove, man. And he took it away. What a stop. Just glove save, glove save, glove save. That's what he did last game, man. He just, just. Ugh. Oh. Landers lost another one. Back in his defensive end to get it. Gathered in by Cassie. The Canucks shift from defense to offense. He's into the slot. Wow. Oh. And he holds on. All right, no fights, guys. Come on. This is not fight. Edmonton's got another win. Grab. And he freezes for the whistle. Hamilton's just on fire. Got the shot, boom, just throws it at the net. And the Canucks with a face off win. The Canucks will st oh, man, is he alright? That was a hit from behind, I seen that too. I did that. Oh, he did that. 
Gonna counter again. Oh my god, I got him with one shot. That was luck. So, I got a guy injected. So my guy just got ejected. So I won the fight, get ejected. Yeah. No, he's not ejected? I thought he was gonna be ejected. Well, we'll find out after his penalty's done. And we'll find out if he gets ejected or not. Clean win on the draw. Decides on the area behind. Ham use has an injury on this play, but he's continued. Another one of their players injured. He's right in front with it. Oh, I don't think he saw Hall just come out of nowhere. Got it at the point. That guy did not see Hall just fly in. He was like, gets the puck, boom, instant destroy. Oh my god. Schultz, Justin Schultz for president. God, Hall just destroyed that guy. So he injures a play, does another big hit, and then we score. Yes. I have to say, everything was great on that play, on that shift. We had a tie game until just moments ago. It's a one goal contest. Laid on to Sestito. Oh, whoa, it did a funny bounce. Broken up well with the poke check. And by number 37, Hemsky's cutting through the neutral zone. Time of the goal. Pointed to Yakupov. Gonna follow me? Slid to Ferentz. Fires. Sent on goal. Routine save there. Wrist shot. Brings a shot. Outstanding save with the glove. He covers and has defused the attack for now. The gloves are off, Doc. There it goes again. Another fight. Ah, oh, he's gonna beat me again. Whoa! Pfft. Yeah, he's already won. Man, that was decisive. Wow, his helmet just flew up right up in the air. Damn, we lost this fight. Hey, hey. Those guys have been eyeing themselves up all night long. God, fights after fights after fights. For five minutes. This is one hell of a game, man. Vancouver's got a defensive zone win. Applied to the safety behind the net. Oh no, get back. Everyone get back. He takes that point pass. Outstanding save. Just on repute. Here comes Spulios. Shoots it on. In on goal and easily handled. Man, oh man, what a hit. I love see. Oh, tremendous save. Denied a terrific chance. Cruises to the slot. Chip to Bonino. Moves up the wing. Puck gathered in behind the net. Scooped up by Petrie. Got that pass up the same side of the ice. Right on his stick on the centering pass. Acrobatic stop by Miller. He made it look easy. What a stop. Fantastic shutdown. One on one. Wrist shot. Great stick save. Pass to the slot. Score! That got tipped by his own player. His own player just tipped it. And I think, I think, I think, I think. Oh, that was hype. I gotta see if that was tipped in by his own player. Let's see. Great weight transfer on this slap shot. A lot of no, it went off his own like his body. Is perfect and he's got the net covered. Let's see. Guess what? He does it. Oh no, it was straight on through shot. Okay. So I guess that's the way to beat Miller now is to, um, stick high. Hamus was injured earlier, guys. He will not return. He's out for the rest of the night. Wow, they're down two players now. Another one of their players injured. And a save. Glides to the safety behind the net. Slides it to the point to Ferentz. Big drive. Two seconds. Not a long pass, but effective. He's got it. Two on one opportunity. Wow. 
Man, another one of their players injured. He can start some oh. danger here. Back and forth they go between the points. Carries it toward the woodwork. Out in front. Shooting. Oh, missed. Good centering pass to the slot. Wide. Wonderful chance. Great save point blank. Uh, with this puck being so close to that, this is all a reaction. Delay of penalty. Oh. Gains the blue line. Back near the blue line to Bonino. Right from the slot. Put it aside. Where is the penalty going to be? Tripping? Oh, slash. But one of their players is now injured again. So they're down three players because of my big hits. Vancouver's power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. The Canucks win it. Ooh, what a break. Shot hit the man. Just Biza. Takes it behind his own cage to Bieksa. Slap to Bonino. Nicely into the zone. Pointed to Bieksa. Blocked with the pad. Gotta ice it here. Cuts between the blue lines. Let's it go. Got a piece of that one. Shoot. Just throw it at the net. That's all I did. If it I went in. Good job. Then, then, uh, okay, I guess we'll have to accept it. Time to look at the shots on goal. 38 for Edmonton and 10 for Vancouver. Horak's goal was late in that. Oh, look at that hit, man. Goes to the locker room smiling with a two goal lead as we had to break. Look at that hit. That guy is totally out for sure. So they're down three players. Penalty time, so the penalty kill will continue on a fresh sheet of ice. Hey, Not Ray, what's going on down there? Here it goes. Hansen's injury is a big one for them. They're losing one of their top scoring forwards. They'll have to patch around that hole sometime. Two Oops. teams have played hard through oh. two, and we begin period three. A desperate lunging save. There was no slashing was call on the play. Never gives up on a play. There was no slashing there? Wow. Thought there would be a slash, but you know what? Whatever. Whatever. Oh, did he stop it with his stick? Look at, let's see. He stopped it with his stick when it would have been wide. What a save by Miller, I have to say. Lander's bad night on faceoffs continues. Lightning in that glove. And a whistle. Don't start stop Batista. Um, yes. Oh, I can't even say his name. Well, he had a good shot, Lander. Look at this. Sloppy puck work. The goalie has to make a save after they should be out of the zone already. Yeah, they should, but they're not. Off the face off, he ties his man up, and so the puck goes to his team. Gets in, looks over his options here. Walking a thin line near the border there. There goes Everly. Carried through center ice. Desperate race to get him. Masterful save. There was no. He tripped me off. Come on. Near the boards. Shoots. Picks it up in his own end. Edmonton survived it. Back even. Takes that pass that was just slipped ahead to him. Catawampus to the corner. The Oilers shift from defense what the to offense. What the heck? What? Drag between the blue lines. Okay, if people just saw that. Um, what? Roped in by Matthias. Good distance on that one to Burroughs. Lifts a little pass to the opposite corner. Looks ahead to start something. Good work through center eyes by Horikov. Knocked it away with the stick. Through center to Matthias. Outlet it to Burroughs. The Oilers will start from their own end. Ah. Uh, um, let's just get it out there. Takes it up near the boards. Little pass that can start some progress ahead. Fires. Waffle boarded. Oh. That's the puck. Long lead pass to Dorset. 
Slides it to the point to Richardson. He got in. He got that one, too. I thought the second was the toughest. With a drive. Deflected off the blocker. Locks on that to Sestito. Ripped along to Richardson. It's an onside play. Oh, he stopped himself the before getting hit. Defense to offense. Long lead pass to Purcell. Score! Julio! Three in a row. Somehow I actually got that amazing shot at the distance away. So now we're turning things around, guys. Four nothing. Four one. The score from the high slot. Just so yes. difficult for the goaltender to read where the puck's going off the back end. Most of the time, because the player doesn't know where it's going either. Edmonton the draw, the tie up, and his team prevails. Propelled to Horak. A shot. A lightning light glove save. There was some room. Not enough. Great glove save. I just threw it at the net seeing if there was a rebound in the pop. Vancouver's fans sitting behind their net got up and showed their respect by bowing to him after that huge save. Over eight minutes have gone by. Do you see a pattern developing here? They're up now by three. Huge stop by Miller. To Verbata. Moves up the side with it now. Come across, come across. Through great. Oh, he got lucky. Oh, but can my guy get the puck? Nope. The wing. Muscled long to Bonino. Good intercept. Edmonton's in complete control of this game because of their ability to force turnovers. Got it on his stick in the slot. Outstanding point blank save. I tipped it and it fumbled with him. I don't think they tipped it anything, but you know what? Maybe I'm, I'm guessing wrong. What an unbelievable save. You can watch games for 10 years and not see a better one. Than that. Canucks with a clean win on the draw. Decides on the area behind. That covers some acreage to Dorset. Sestito's doing everything he can, guys. Another one of their players is injured. On to Daniel Sedin. Oh, and he's hit yet again. Shot, wonderful work in close and a brilliant save. I think, did an, oh my god, they, I think they lost another player. from this area of the ice. Great save. Blockered away. Lombed on two by Cassie. Gathered in by Edler. Back near the blue line to Petrie. Glides across. Wonderful save. A cover and play is stopped. Oh, come on. Jesus put the glove in his face. He's been doing that all night long. Come on, you can show the hit. What happened to the player? I actually want to see the hit. Sestito's been in this oh, wow. He game. got ran over. I, you can just barely see it, but he got ran over by Hall. A little over seven minutes to go in the period. Do you see a pattern developing here? They're up now by three. The so they're down the another off. player. To Matthias. Tanev shaken up on the play, but he's gamely hanging in out there. Another one of their players going to be out soon. To Burroughs. Puck gathered in behind the net by Ferentz. Up the wing to Hamilton. Uh, and the linesmen were watching very carefully. I, I, I was trying to pass to Hamilton, but I messed up. Yeah, they were hurting big time. They've lost most of their players. Edmonton's got that neutral zone faceoff. Gathered in by Edler. Up the wing. The Oilers will start from their own end. Many yards gain to Yakupov. Wrist shot. Terrific glove save. Gets play stopped. <laughs> I love how I just slide right in and just like, let's go for the shot. Miller's playing net better than anyone right now. He's doing whatever it takes to keep the puck out of the net. Yes, he is, and it's doing a great job. Quick 
Work on the faceoff. Save! Let's it go. Oh, he'll pay for that. Oh, fight gonna happen? And so the scrap is underway, but not the original matchup. Nope, very failing. Very failing. Yes, won it. Well, he kept fight. He kept picking fights with that one, so I come over there and fight and finally beat him. Oh, he went right at the. He barely hits the goaltender. And yeah. So they lost another. They lost the defenseman this time for five minutes. Oops, I, I played as defenseman. Laid on to Horak. He'd given a pass, now he gets one. Good solid defensive play there. Pointed to Petrie. Let's go, Arister. Oops. Better pull back, pull back. Up the wing with it now. Puck taken behind the net by Petrie. First lines. The Oilers shift from defense to offense. To Hall. That's Hall. He's creating chances for his teammates with two assists so far. Great glove save. Last minute to go in the third. Shook right through. Has glove oh. on it. He covers and a face <laughs> what, what was I doing there? I was dancing around back and forth. What? Are they going to show the replay of it? And so we've been on the receiving end of more than a few of these things. This is why you retire from the game. What a gorgeous hit. Luckily, he didn't get injured there. At ice level with Ray. Sestito's injury is going to leave them shorthanded up front. One of their top forwards, he will not return to tonight's game. Solid, clean win. A good score! And that's four straight goals. What? That one. What? What? The reason you take a one timer is not allowing the goaltender to get set. That's exactly what happened. That's been tipped. Once Let's, that puck I, I can't even see. Let's see. It was off and then behind the goaltender. Oh. What? Sometimes your best isn't enough. This is a perfect shot up over a desperation attempted glove save. Okay. So we're into the last minute. All is academic here. Slid to Spiza. Right up the middle to Bonino. Takes it on the wing. Lofted back to the opposite corner. Glides to the safety behind the net. Big hit. Wow, they flip and finally get a big hit. You go through that area of the ice, there's a pretty good chance you're going to get hit. Using the point. Kick save. Routine. Goaltender pass. Brought ahead. They've got a two on one. Toward the net. He scores. Second of the game. What a performance. <laughs> Miller tried there. Miller literally went and tried to save that goal. But it just came up a little short. So we'll see this goal again. Here we go. Look at this. I was like, uh, I should go back and do the old pass pass across. He's like, I'm like, no, I'm going to go this way. And then I'm going to go whoop, pass across. And she just tips it in. Miller tried his best there. Edmonton's got it off the draw at center. By number 83, Parked in the slot and it's on his stick. What? What was going on with Miller there? Did he like glitch out or something? So we'll see right here, guys, what's going on with Miller. High scoring area, a wrist shot is a great choice. I thought he would have had that. Some sweet hands. That's a soft dish right on the tape. Oh, he got into that position and he couldn't really do anything about it. So three goals like just like that in the last minute. Edmonton's got another face-off win. Accidentally blocked. A terrific challenge. Outstanding save. The goalie makes himself look big. Finally win a game. Finally. And finally they get a rest. 
because the game's over. That's what you talked about being outed. No chance here tonight. Finally beat us above, though. Oh, they switched goaltenders halfway. I didn't see so that. The teams have left the ice and are getting rested. Look at that. Boom. Time. Score. Time, for Eddie and Ray, Mike Emmerich saying... Three stars of the game. Adam Ladd, one goal, three assists. Jordan Eberle, one goal, two assists, two hits. Justin Schultz. 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 I, I, I can't even say his name. One goal, one assist, four hits. That's a good game, at least, man. Ugh. So we got time for one more game, guys. Well, because I usually make my videos pretty long. Don't you have, if I have to say myself? <laughs> well. Okay, but first, we got to do a trade. And I will be trading one of my defensemen. I don't know which one though. Let's see. Um, pff, well, actually, I'm gonna trade two of these guys just to get this. Um, I'm not using him. No, he's in the OHL. I'm. No, he's in the minor league. I'm giving up our captain. Andrew Ferentz is going to go and... I, mean, I just want to see what's salary. Um, wow, Andrew Ferentz had a three point. Jeff Petrie, I'm not going to get rid of. Probably this defenseman right here. Not Dan Hine. Ryan Gianta. <sighs> Trying to think. Da, 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 um, not really. Plus, I gotta look at the other teams too, see their seller cap. Patrick Elias is pretty good. Oh wow, it says right down there at the bottom, it's 46 out of 15 contracts. Sweet. Winnipeg Jets will take both of them. I am what? See if I can get their first round pick for that. No, I won't be able to shoot. Maybe their second round. We will see. Oh, they won't accept it because of the... Okay. I could get their second round pick for this one. Let's see. Okay, they accept it. That's good. Now, if I could get Hal Gill signed just before our next game, then it'll be good. Let's see. Please, Hal Gill, accept this. Um, dang, I'm gonna have to do this now. 
Or I cannot do that so far, let's see. Can I still pick up Hell Kill? Maybe. Possibly. Hopefully. You kidding me? I'm trying to wait for a defenseman. If he's gonna accept a flipping contract. WHL, check the defensemen's. Do two weeks for defensemen's there. God damn it, I didn't get to sign Hell Gill in time. Now I gotta fix the lines. Dang! And that means I have to call someone up. Yeah. Well, I have this guy actually up and I- oh shoot. So I wonder what they did. I think they they screwed with the lineups a bit. Yes, they did. They did do stuff with the lineups. I noticed it now. Ah, damn it! I thought I told them not to. Okay, so. Swap. Fence of Paris. I guess I'll stick with no, I don't. Warning, no lines. Yeah, I know who doesn't have a line. No, I want Pouliot. Where is he? Where is he? Yeah, I know you're good. I just want Chris Pronger because he has a hell of a shot. Penalty kill. Orkoff with Eberle. Eberle's there, but now I want Hopkins with. Wait, actually, I'm gonna do something different. Put him as a scratch for a second. Changing current line. No, I, I want Chris Pronger there because he is a better defenseman. But you could be on the three, okay. Okay, that's done. Markov Hall. Sure, why not? I don't know what I'm doing right now. Uh, no, you, it's gonna be Emski. Extra. Uh, no. Changing current line. Okay, um, goalies. Fine. Scratched. Yeah, he's a scratch. No lines. This game's being stupid right now. And actually, I have no captain unless it just assigned one. No, it just gave me all assistance right now. And this is only the beginning of the season still, but... I wonder if I can make Horkoff the captain. Okay, uh, I'm sorry about that. I mean, or can I not make a captain? Oh, I can. I can.
Oh, okay. So I've, I'm putting Horkov back as a captain because he was originally once a captain, so yes. But so far, I got everyone back. I will be getting Hal Gill next game. Probably after next game. Hopefully he signs. I'm not saying he will or not. Tons of team with Yoni picking in. I don't want him. I did sign him, I'm just wondering if he's going to accept it. Unless he says no, I decline because it's not what I want. Oh, I see right there what teams want him. Dustin Penner used to be an oiler. Ryan Jones. I, I don't know if I want to sign Ryan Jones. Maybe, maybe not. Ryan Whitney. Koivu. Pretty good. A lot of good people. All, I know these a lot of these names playing old NHL games like 07, 08, 10, um, 06 actually I played too. 05 I did not play. I still have a lot of sentiments, so I have cent centers. So I should get probably do something about that soon. So I traded two defensemen for a second round pick. Um, no, we're not going orange today. Okay. Uh. Oh, okay. 06, 07, home. That's what the one I want. Tampa Bay. They were so close, but they did not win the Silent Cup. I was cheering for that team all. I was like, come on, Tampa. But they just came up short. Dang. They could possibly win it next year. If they do their best, they could possibly win it next year. Yes. Edmonton? Yeah, maybe. They really have to turn things around. Because since 06, the last time they were actually in the playoffs, they have never been in since. Not once. The They've come close, but no. Team has had outside the downtown area of Edmonton, outside is a statue of the great Wayne Gretzky. Inside another game of the Edmonton Oilers. Two and three and three, one and one. Right before game time here. It's Damn it, why don't they bring that thing down and show like the Oilers coming out of it? Only play a third of the time do they ever make a contribution. Well, you need them, Doc, to make those big contributions. Star players are a real important cock to the success of your team. Because if you don't have a lot of them, you're not going to have much success. Okay, so let's look at the starting goaltenders Boom. for the game. Ben Scrivens is in goal. A One, two, oh. All the way, but on his way up, he led the American Hockey League by yielding the fewest goals in a season. For that, he won a prize trophy, the Half Holmes Memorial Award. Evgeny Nabokov has had a marvelous career, which continues in this game. Rookie of the Year at one time, NHL All-Rookie Team member a decade and a half ago with San Jose. That took place. First All-Star team with a league leading 46 wins seven years later. Nabokov. Yep, it's former San Jose Shark. Had many bad nights early in the season. As a result, they've got that winning record. Their ability to move the puck and contain the opposition in the defensive zone has been wonderful so far this year. To Stamkos. Well, Stamkos lost the puck and... Oh, wonderful play. Tampa Bay's minor penalty is for slashing. Oh, okay. I was wondering, too. I was like... I, I had to stop and think, like, what? What's going on? And then oh, I see now. the reaction of the puck carrier. He is in some pain. That's a slash. Yeah, we're looking at boards. Yeah! The Oilers have a decided Ford's got the penalty. on the power play between the two teams. Tonight, it'll be really important to stay disciplined and stay out of the penalty box. Don't come out. Edmonton's what are you doing? Do not come out when I'm coming out. He's got that one. Let's see what happens. Front, off, the goal. off the... Point blast. Waffle boarded. 
He can start some danger here. Glides across to Viznovsky. Oh, another save. He drives to the net. Oh. Shooting. Nope. Must get it out. Okay, switching lines. Don't come out. The power play unit has to recoil and try yet again. That's that, really. Carried through the middle. They gain the zone, but there are two men back. Great nope. job on a cut pass. And then you hit my defenseman. Gets in, looks over his options here. Nope, nope. We'll just take it up nice and slow. Receives that pass from the other side. Oh, here's a wrister. He's in on goal. Terrific. Oh, what a shot. What a... Oh, I really came Once close. Goals, you have to go to this area. You got to find a way to put it in the net. Tampa Bay survived it. Back even. Propelled to Callahan. Pass it to Everly. Oh, what a save by Nabokov. Diagonally to Johnson. Neutral zone carry. Feathered back in. Collected uh, by Taylor Hall. Third line on. Carries it toward the woodwork. Right from the slot. Rister got a piece of that one. Terrific pass through the middle. He's got it on his stick. Can he generate something? Sets up shot. Out in front. Ooh, that one accidentally blocked. Oh, that's at least good. It was blocked. It's a three on two. How will they defend this? Wrist shot. Left wing pass to Johnson. Right near the line. Can he keep it going? And he finished defensive pass too. The neutral zone. He could start some. Oh, I didn't get the puck. Picks it up in his own end. Can he generate something from there? Collected by Yoansu. Passed up the middle for Hamilton. Here comes Hamilton Lander. Looks ahead to start something. And I missed the hit. Uses the middle of the ice for Philpola. Philpola. Um, used to play for Detroit to the Red Wings. Takes it behind his own cage. Team changing. To Petrie. To Hamilton. Up the wing. That's... Oh, that was a bad pass. Another bad pass. <laughs> Taken right up the middle. And offside is okay. called on the play. Horkoff was just a bit off. Nabokov's put to the test after a turnover right in front of him. Yep, but he came up and saved it. Edmonton's start is making a long year going to look a lot longer if they don't turn this around pretty soon. They've had no offensive balance to their lineup so far, and it's really hurt them. It's an onside play. Laid on. Look at the hall, right the hall. Nice job, straight stand. <sighs> I lost the puck. He's in. Brilliant. And he got it. <laughs> Dang. Bad play, bad, and just, oh, I should have dove for it, but I didn't. I was hoping, that we were going to get that first one. Tampa Bay's got that one. Michael Blunden assisted. Good intercept. Time of the goal. Moves up along the board. Oh, not offside again. Demkos. Maybe Demkos. A little under eight minutes to go first period. Tampa Bay's got the lead, 1-0. Tampa Bay's collected another victory on the faceoff. Good distance on that one. What are you going to do? come frame from? Back in his defensive end to get it. Here comes Jack Puff. Cutting through the neutral zone. That's the back. Oh, no. Pass. Wow, what a glove save. He can start some danger here to Hemsky. Eric Brewer, oh, that's who I wanted to get to. Oh, oh no, that's fine. Big time save, big time shooter. Chip 
to Yakupov. Perfect receipt of the pass. At the front of the oh, what a pass. That was amazing how it got past two defensemen. Amazing, man. Look, he passes to Hall, and then Hall's like, I'll pass it back. Boom. Hall's able to clear open ice, and he lays a sweet saucer pass on the shooter's stick. Uh, if Novakov was saved, I would have said that would have be been an amazing save, but he came up a little short. They win the draw and will now set up an attack. By number 64. Take it away. Oh, little pass that can start some progress ahead. And by number 80. Many yards gained to Hedman. Look at this. Oh. Right on goal. Fourth, they go between the points. Oh, what tic tac toe play! Ah, oh. they get one back. Come on, Ben. Ben, scrimmage. Look at this. Boom. I should have tried a poke check, but I didn't. I was thinking about it, but then I was like, uh, should I? However, the puck spins over the goal line. Face off win, and now what will they do with it? Puck gotten behind the net by Prung. Ahead on that left wing to Nugent Hopkins. Here comes Everly. Let's it fly. Wonderful stop by Nabokov. A quality score, and the game is. There was no flipping way that could have gone in. There was no way, but it went in still. So we bounce back, score again. Jordan Eberle! Look at this, look at this. An amazing shot. Look at this pass. Whoop. It went off the goaltender ahead of him, but whatever. whatever. However it went in, guys, that was an amazing shot. And save. Solid win at center ice. Move to the shadow of the boards by Johnson. And he dumps it in. Johnson's on the limp after that big hit, Doc. He's working his way slowly to the bench. Fires. Well handled. Oh, Johnson's hurt. Oh, no. To Strawman. Time of the goal. Oh, no. And they've got a three on two here. Keeps it going back behind the net. Directed on. Oh, what a terrific save in close. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. The opening period has been completed. Tied at two. A look now at the lopsided shot totals. Boom, first goal. For Edmonton, four for the Lightning. Boom. Everly's goal has tied this game. Intermission is yeah, I think it went off the goaltender. I know. All the fans are happy. Yes. We are in the early stages of this game, about to begin the second period. Your thoughts on the first? The Bolts goaltender hasn't been perfect, but without him, the score could be a lot worse. Expect to see better team defense from his guys and try to turn the tables the other way. Grabbed off by Taylor Hall. On to Nugent Hopkins. Back near the blue line to Hall. Shoot! Glides to the safety behind the net. Led on to Pillai. Takes it up that side. Slid to Hedman. Wow, what an open ice hit. To the corner. Delayed penalty call. That covers some acreage to Nugent Hopkins. Back in front. Blockered away. Goalie to the bench, extra man over the boards on the delayed penalty. Scorches one. Score! A pair of goals by the same team. Well, no penalty there. Oh, they are still giving me the penalty because it's a five minutes. Wow. So I get a goal and then we get the power play. Yes. Paul's decision was pretty easy. This low on a slot. Just snap Boom. it off and he did. Nabokov's in the default butterfly position, but he doesn't cover the net. There's still room there. Yeah, but he didn't he didn't see it that well because he got screened. The 
Rangers power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. Well, maybe we'll get some here. Tampa Bay's got it off the draw at center. Scored by number. And the linesmen were watching very carefully. That is an offside. Hey. Assisted by number 19 and by number two, Jeff Petrie. I have no clue what the penalty was. Nope, they're not going to talk about the penalty. The Oilers oh. Takes it up near the oh, hitting from behind. It was a hit from behind. Oh. What a pass. I don't even think that should have went. That pass should have been deflected. Drew Carper and Blue. Purcell's had some chances in this game. He finally scores on the back end. Whoa, it looks like his trapper's got a hole in it there, and so he gets beat low to the glove side. <laughs> he sat there right there waiting for the puck. Yes. Over three minutes have elapsed here in the second. Edmonton's lead on the strength of that recent goal is two. The Oilers control from the neutral zone. Lifted on goal, that's why the goalie's there. To Johnson. Laid on to Callahan. So on this power play, they will resume from their own end of the ice. Through the neutral zone. Pointed to Viznovsky. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. The Oilers shift from defense to offense. Moves and here comes our barrier at center ice. Wonderful centering. Huge stop by Nabokov. Talking about making it look easy. With a shot. Offensive zone pickup by Taylor Hall. To Petrie. Oh, what score! A power play goal yet again. That's the second one that's been. Blocked by defenseman, picked up, and scored. Nugent Hopkins knew he was in a prime scoring area, so he went to the wrist shot and scored. Nabokov's made himself a little smaller here. It's opened up some room over his stick side shoulder. Yep. Well, he tried to save, but didn't come up. So we're still on the power play. And that's two power play goals back to back. The Oilers from the neutral zone start to work. Good centering pass to the slide. Right along the blue line to Viznowski. 2.48 left. Hall's looking for some trouble here. Doc, you were hoping for a dance. Well, there you go. 28 seconds. Nope, you got that block count. And I'm gonna lose this. It's a takedown, and that's it. He threw a lot of punches, didn't land many. Eventually he just says to heck with it and he takes them down. Well, time for Bay, he's got all their energy back. Oh, face wash, yeah, I'm gonna have to pick a fight. At least five minutes in the box. A little under five minutes gone. Edmonton's offense, another celebration just moments ago. Their lead is three. Well, someone's sticks broke. Nicely received at the point. Shoots. Terrific save. Terrific opportunity. Not a lot of room to score from in that area. Great save. Oh, come on. He passed it with his glove. Nope. Nope. Nothing. Oh, now he gets a stick. The shot's delivered quickly, but he smothers the bottom of the He did too. And he, did he almost knock it in? Let's see. And nope. Edmonds blocked so many pucks over the last couple of games, you would think you'd like to stick handle one of them once in a while. Defensive zone win. Hangs on to that one, and he'll see a face off right near it. Oh, what a hit. I hope he's okay. That's a dangerous hit. <laughs> Try to pick a fight after I did two hits. Quick work 
on the faceoff. He's got that pass at the point. On through the corner. Muscled long. Got that. Tremendous scoring chance. Oh, the goalie was screened on that shot. You got to rely on your positioning to make that save. To Pronger. Marches on a cross. Shoots. Oh, a great reaction there as that one was tipped on goal. Edmonton's going back to get restarted with their advantage. Chip to Nugent Hopkins. Got it on his stick in the slot. Good quick poke check there. Take it to the slot. And oh, changed. I should have went for the shot. On that pass. Decides on the area behind. And played through center for oh. Nugent Hopkins. I, got too, I went too fast. Oh, wow. He tipped it perfectly. But it just didn't go. A face-off win. Let's see what develops. And drives on through center. Mashed in. Edmonton's going back further to get restarted on this man advantage. To Petrie. Petrie's passing in this game has been outstanding. He has stick two broke. assists so far. Got to clear it here. Knocked right off the stick. Taken behind by Puglia. In the slot. Wonderful stop. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save. Knock out in front. It's off his pad. Tampa Bay has done it. Back at full strength. Takes that pass that was just slipped ahead to him. Flipped to the opposite corner by Johnson. Fires. Save. And he'll hold on. What a long penalty. And power play. Sometimes there's just nowhere to go with the puck. Guys, this is an excellent shot, but the goaltender makes an excellent pad save. Yep, good save. Just a little under nine minutes played here in the second. The Oilers just keep building on that earlier lead. They're up now by three. The Oilers will start from their own end. He's in front with it. Wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. Not often you're all alone in front of the goaltender from this area of the ice. Great save. Neutral zone pickup here by Yoensu. To Hamilton. On to Yoensu. Save! Shoots it off. Deflected off the blocker. Why off. Oh, close call there. Everything's got to go through the middle of the ice. That's exactly where he was, but he missed the chance. Blocked. He drives toward the slot. He's got a chance. Kick save. Outstanding. Oh, what he great shots and everything. Shot saves everything. Perfect. The has been sharp all night. Excellent pad save yep, on a great save. shot. Brandon Morrow used to play for Dallas Stars. Good face off win. He's going to the net, and he'll cover. Lander, I think he's the lead scorer for our team. Like, for goals, but not points. Or maybe both, I don't know. Good clean win on the draw. Terrific glove save. There was some room. Not enough. Great glove save. Great shot. Lightning reflexes with the glove hand. I might write down all the goals that happened for my team. Or all goals in total in the videos. They win it. Point to point it goes to Viznovsky. Knocked away. Right up. Oh, a save. Takes it on the wing. Grabbed off by <laughs> To Horkov, to Yakupov, out in the slot, 
Gaining space, maybe Tom takes that pass from the other point. Oh, that was a bad. Near the boards. The scrum to the plexiglass. Picks it up in his own end. Through center. Slid to Hall. Save. Enormous hit. No penalty on that. Learns cut through the neutral zone. We're going to get a penalty. It's a delay. Oh, there's a penalty. I did a, a bit of an interference. The battery the better not die on me. Um, interference, yes, I know. Up on the penalty clock for interference. Tampa Bay's power play opportunity number is one. This one, the first one. You only get one chance to make a good first impression. Let's see if they do. And gathered in by. Oh, I had the puck in. Oh no, Everly just walked back. Everly's clearly in some anguish here. He's working his way back to the bench, but he's hurt. He's right in front with it. Drives to the net. What a save, considering the shooter that's usually in. What? At the corner by Steven Stamkos. Right in front. Got his pad on that one. Everly just went back. Tries to get it on net. Got a piece of that one. Moved along and in. A chance to clear. Carried toward the woodwork by Lander. It's a two on two. What do they do next? Gloved. Up the wing with it now. From the right side to the middle, right on nice. the tape. Now we'll find out what happened to Everly. Oh god, please tell me we didn't lose Everly. Yeah, let's see. Nope, he's just hurting a bit. Thank God. Oh, thank God it wasn't something serious. I would have freaked just out. Under three minutes still to play in this period. The Oilers just keep building on that earlier lead. Their advantage is three. Carried toward the woodwork by Everly. Oh, and he is drilled. There's a phrase in hockey. Hit. <laughs> <laughs> no, my hit was even crazier, man. We got to see that hit. Come on, you got to show that hit. Scrimmage is moving side to side, but he's able to get the pads flat Look at to this. the ice to make Oh, you don't get to see it, but man, that was a hit. I come over and I I just nail him. And he goes flying right into the boards. Oh, that's funny. Quick work on the face off. Long lead passed. Why? Edmonton survived it. Back even. Ref the in the way. Something, a delayed call here. Boarding. The Oilers are guilty of a minor penalty for Paul's back right in the penalty box. Tampa Bay's power play gets another chance to operate. Great glove grab. And he freezes for the whistle. 18 minutes, 8 seconds. The Oilers with a clear oh, draw. Yeah, I'll just give it away. Let's go, Rister. Got his glove on it. Oh, the hands are quicker than a glove. Great save. Two guys together with force. Big hey. Yeah. Oh, that was a dangerous hit. Now he's what? gonna have to answer to somebody with that hit. The Oilers have a player who is done for the night. A game misconduct. What happened? Interference? Where? This was a dangerous play for interference. Oh, he shoved him into my goaltender that one and he gets Tampa Bay special teams have been special. Let's see if they come up big here. It's a two So I just lost Petrie for the game. Oh, big sweeping save. So I lost Petrie for the rest of the game, I think. At the point of drive. Angled to Strawman. Carries it up the wing. Takes that cross ice pass. Cursed by a broken stick. The cursed goals are the ones in the first minute and the last. Will we see one here? Swept Strawman. Moves up the side with it now. Good hand to eye. And the reach of the stick. Hendricks has got it. Can he oh, I fired it right into the bench. Puck out of play over the glass. And a young lady from Shawinigan came up with that. 
Edmonton's defense hasn't been perfect. They've given up some quality chances. Look at this. But when you got a goalie behind Boom. you with a glove like that, what a great that, He could bail you out at the perfect time. Barkov comes in. They win the draw. Hey! You got to battle through a screenplay. He got it in. A magnificent pad save. Right on his stick. Can he get it out? Well, he took that shot right off the face. Oh, open ice here. And he slides it on through the middle. So I think I just lost Jeff Petrie for the rest of the game for an interference call. I don't know how that happened, but okay, I gotta accept it then. And 15 for the Lightning. Begun the third period. Onside. Oh, what a play! Here comes Hall. Nope. Oh, they get a five minute for that interference call. Good poke check by Horikov. Can he make him chase it? Carries it up the side. Cranks a shot. Nice job with the pad that time. Propelled to Garrison and played through center for Phil Pilla. And he motors on through the neutral zone. Slides it to the point to Phil Pilla. Here comes Hall. They must retreat and start back again. Lots on that to Garrison. Takes that pass from the other point man. What a <laughs> shot, but it's off the post. Dragged through the neutral zone by Hedman. Good centering pass to the slot. Outstanding save. Just on reputation. They score! Ah, finally got a goal. By a pair. On their 5 on 3, they score. We score twice. Sorry, let's say it again. We scored before the penalty. What? No, during during there was a penalty delay to lead to that five-minute penalty, and then we get two goals during that power play. But I I messed up there. So they get their first goal. Tampa Bay's got another face-off win. Gets in. What will he do? Pass to the net. Oh, this puck being so close to that, this is all a reactionary save. Puck picked up in the neutral zone by Johnson. Taken up the middle. Laid on to Horkoff. Oh, it did a funny bounce there. Oh, you want to fight? Might be something here. He's want to fight? Just looking his eyes all night long. No surprise. Oh, nope, we got to fight up. here. Can Callahan turn this around? Yeah, he's going to turn it around. Nope, got him. And now the penalties for sure. Maybe repairs. No defense in that one. Thank God we got everybody boosted up now again. Oh, so he picks the fight with Pronger and Pronger just destroyed him. And that's why also I want Hal Gill because he's a good fighter, but he's also very tall and he could... Support the puck. Very unpredictable makes it tough for the penalty killers to stymie them because they don't know where the next attack is coming from. Time of the penalty. Chip to Garrison. No shadow of the boards here. Side to side they go, trying to generate something. Acrobatic stop by Scrivens. Oh, that's a prime scoring area. What a save. Nope, went off this. by Hedman. Tampa Bay's power play has ended. They've not been good. Back in his defensive end to get it. 
flings it. Oh my god. His first game of the season, he gets his first goal of the season. Well, the kids gotta be happy. And plus, if we don't get how go, I guess I can keep that guy. They're up now by three. Tampa Bay's got another face-off win. Assisted by number 19. Time of the goal. That one comes right on his stick. Not very long, but good. The Oilers shift from defense to offense. Right up the side. Nice job to get it from that winger to center ice. And it's pitched back in to get a change. What a marvelous collision. Unless you're in it. The physical play in this game is really picked up, and there's a perfect example of that. The Oilers will start from their own end. Yeah, there is. Been... Moves up the wing. It's an odd man rush. It's a three on two. Save. Travel. Magnificent save. He was in control on both of those saves. Wrist shot and a save. He's into the slot. Wonderful work in close and a brilliant save. And I want to get my fourth line on. Glass, a souvenir for some young fan. So satisfying to have delivered a hit like that. Down Sorry, we don't get to see the hit again, guys. Sorry. He missed the net. Chance after chance, another missed opportunity. This team is down. We know why. Hamilton's carrying it through center. Oh, a save. Cruises to the slot. Up. Oh. And I, I forget the puck. Picked up in the attacking zone. Looking from the blue line to Pronger. Wonderful save on the redirect. Lander tipped it perfectly. Nice. Okay, guys, let's do this. We can win this game. If not, then we're... That's it. We're in trouble. Let's go. Good face-off win. Score! Justin Schultz. What a slapper, man. He got it, just instantly go for the slap. That's back to back games, he's got goals. Look at this. His pretty easy. Grip it and <laughs> rip it. What a slap shot. Grip it, rip it, shoot it, score it, everything. Everyone's looking at the top of the net and the stick side was wide. I think they're gonna have to switch goaltenders after that. Seven goals, yeah. I would. Neutralized face-off win. By number by to Nugent Hopkins. Nugent Hopkins has been a playmaking. What a save by Nabucco. That save was much more difficult than it looked. No hits from behind. On to Johnson. All Hall's going to come back and do the hit. Gets in and he'll look over his options. As that point passes well. Save. Moves it to the shadow of the boards. It's a three on two. How will they defend this? Shoots. Waffle boarded. Back near the blue line to Viznovsky. Slid to Strawman. Second line. Roped in by Stamkos. He's into the slot. Oh. Charged up the wing by Morrow. Carries it toward the woodwork. Well, Morrow just got his Picks bells rung. His own end. And played through center for Horkoff. Oh, Horkoff comes in. All by himself. Fires. Huge stop by Nabokov. They don't ask how. He just did. Yep. Don't ask. Just he did. Draw the tie up and his team prevails. Up the wing. Flip to the opposite corner. Oh, he's pretty clearly shaken up. He's just gliding slowly off the ice dock after that big hit. Gains the save. Another takes it behind his own cage. To Ponick. Good pass up that wing. The Oilers shift from defense to offense. Moves up along the boards. Zone Delay penalty. Capulia. Scrivens has made it to the bench. Extra players on. Tampa Bay's got two for boarding. 
Oh, boarding. Oh, I think I know where the head is. Let's see what it is. I'm thinking I know what it is. Did you see the yep. player face? That's the, the one right there. Make contact with that player while he has no chance to protect himself. Sorry, guys. I was drinking some boarding. from my cup. Edmonton's power play has Bring been some water. effective, and it gets yet another chance off of this face-off. Big face-off win. Accidentally blocked. Got it all. Gets play stopped. Pronger just ripped that shot and just nailed someone. But I really took a sh rebound shot, came up a little short. Hedman's done an excellent job over the last couple of games defensively. Where he stands out the most is his ability to get into the shooting lanes and block shots. The Oilers have a manpower advantage still and begin from their own end. Big Tattoo all the way. And on the two on two, can they get reinforcements here? Must oh. get it out. To Stamkos. Gathered in by Pronger. Oh, we can take on that. To Nugent Hopkins. Oh, nope, never mind. Takes it up that side. In the slot, he's taking a perfect centering pass. Terrific save there. Didn't look like he had anything to shoot at, and he made it tough. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you've got to find a way to put the puck in the net. Moves to the barrier at center ice by Garrison. Many yards gained to Callahan. Gets that one on across. Pass ahead through center for Purcell. Walking a thin, outstanding save by Nabokov. Edmonton's power play still needs work. Oh, uh, so um, 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 look at that. Did no one just see off. that? I, that's what made me, what the fuck just happened there? In total scramble mode to make the stop. What happened to that guy? That guy was freaking out. Wow. I, I think I might have to save that as a moment. I have to maybe put that as a highlight. On the face off of the neutral zone. Propelled to Phil Pula. 60 seconds. Seems like a long time when you're the bug. Looks ahead to start something. Laid on to Hall. Takes it up near the boards. It's a three on two as they move in. Fires. Cut his glove on it. He covers, and a face-off will follow. Might be something coming up here. He has been looking for this for a while. Man, that is creepy, man, that guy. He's floating the air. Edmonton's quick on the draw. In front! Fires! Deflected off the blocker. Muscled long to Johnson. Collected by Johansson. Oh. Point blast. Great glove save. Oh, that puck just hit his glove. <laughs> I love that play. Edmonton's got it again. Back in his defensive end to get it. Chip to Philpola. The clock is at zeros. The game is over. And the buzzer sounds. Three stars. Justin Schultz. Two, Schultz. Surgical. One goal. Two assists. Two hits. Ryan Hopkins. Surgeon. One goal. Two assists. One hit. Hall. One goal. One assist. Three hits. That's some good water, I have to say. Nice, cold, refreshing water. So, guys, this is going to be the end of this stream and video. Since, well, I do stream most of my videos. What can I say? But I hope you all enjoyed. And you know what? If you like this video, you could hit that like button. But I'm not saying you have to. It's up to you if you want to. And if you want to subscribe, you can. But it's up to you. I'm not saying you should. I'm saying you. it's up to your choice. If you want to do this stuff and I will and I hope that everyone actually enjoyed it because
Sorry about that, guys. I might have slightly paused it there. I might have hit the wrong thing. But I hope you guys all enjoyed this. And I will see you guys next time with NHL 15. This is Credo Soul 21 signing off. Bye now.